This is from a friend of mine. She wants this mix and match. But has a lot of work to do. Someone uh, tried to start redo and I don't like to say bad things about the work the other people, but this is a really bad shape. And everything is messed up. The drawers. Need to fix everything. And this has glue on the top. Lose the, the guides, the drawers guides. Is a big, big project I need to do. This is a mess. This top is a mess. It's not a solid wood. Have you can see this crepes on the sides? It's sparkly wood or something like that. Let's go to start and stay tuned and see how this project turns out. First is the first time got to remove all the hardware for do a good clean. I'm going to start with the chest. I'm going to cleaning first and see how many um, need, uh, fix need you to do. This is right to just has some um, just some um, guides to fix it and ready to go to paint. to use Dixie Bell slick stick because this is too, too slicky this uh, top I'm going to apply with a roller and uh, a brush I'm going to use Rostan Olean uh, chocolate uh, paint in white linen. I got to apply with my uh, gun machine and of course I use my, my um, mask. Let's go to paint.
chest is ready to primer and paint the fixes is all done I use bondo the corner of the top is almost perfect I'm going to skip this part the primer and paint because I am uh, do the same I did on the chest of the drawers the problem why the drawers now close properly is that back you see it's not the right is in good shape but this back is out the looks like you have too many humidity and uh, it's not straight anymore i'm gonna take it out because it's always out of the space and now leave the drawers close well i'm going to take it off I needed to make holes on uh, guides because the support was the cardboard has under and this little uh, nails. I need to take it off all the rights and make a hold for security. start to remove all the rides for make uh, holes and use uh, I need to make a holes here and take it off this little nails to uh, drill my, my holes on my guides, my uh, drawers guides. This top, I'm going to start with uh, 80 uh, grips and paper and move to the 120 and the 220. After sand with 80 degrees and paper and 120, and still have the scratch because the scratch is too deep and this is not solid wood this is sparkly wood and has a tiny tiny uh, veneer top I can because the scratch goes down of the veneer what I'm doing now the scratch is so uh, deep I'm going to mix will feel uh, and mix with water I think I need you a little bit more water now my wood filler uh, is dry the dry overnight I'm going to send with 220 grip some paper
definitely need you another coat with a wash wood filler because the scratch is not covered. At this time I'm going to do the wood filler a little bit more leaky. Let's go to see if this all these scratches were is covered. And we'll do the same I did before, but this time more leaky. I'm going to use metallic silver. guys Maggie here from Free French Your Mom before the final review I want to talk a little bit about this project very very happy or how this turns out was a big project it took me <laughs> a time consuming I can say how long because I started this project in May and I'm just finished now this three piece I need to tell you guys when my friend called me and asked me if I can redo uh, this uh, three piece for her daughter uh, she told me it's supposed to this goes in in a um, damp she has this for a while in her barn for goes to the damp and her teenager daughter saw this on a, on a barn and she wants this for her bedroom and she told me it was in a rough shape and I said oh I'm very happy to do this for uh, um, to your daughter when she bring this to me and I look close and oh my gosh, my thoughts was take this back girl. But I look better and says, okay, this will be a challenge for me. Can you guys tell me on the comments below why the guys think I nailed this <laughs> or not? I'm so proud of myself to save three more pieces of furniture from the dump and bring them to the, the life many many years to coming here the sneak peek for next week video i love so much this will be fun stay tuned and see the full transformation thank you so much for watching i hope the guys enjoy like i did to make it see you next one bye <laughs>